morning to you, laddies. It's uh, still walking. So I'm about to see what was the name of my first stream that I saw yesterday. Anywho, welcome. Uh, what was I training? I was training fighting in Axis. Sounds good. What kind of uh, wearing do I have? Plate armor plus three. Sweet. Executioner acts of flaming. Great. Well then, <clears throat> let's get started, shall we? Um, what I was doing last time was... Uh, Going to the Orcish Mines, and this time around I'm about to um, go for the Lair. Let's see, Lair L1. Enter. Or we'll meet Hoggoblins on the way. Um, I just uh, sold a cell phone to a guy. So I'm a bit whooshy. Let's see. Uh, Komodo Dragon hisses angrily. I hiss him back. Uh, the lair. What can I say about the lair? Not very much. I think uh, on my main dude, I'm uh, on my main dude. Yeah, because I only have one main. No, on my main, I. Uh, I'm level 13, which you saw in the start. Just checking. Hello, Hippogriff. I'm playing a bit of a chicken. And we're going to burn that book. Burn your book. I see that I am fully, fully fledged with the trog. That is good. I also see that my uh, health bar is full. That means I probably have the uh, ring of the gourmand. I meant the uh, the amulet of the gourmand. Ring of teleportation controlled, ring of fire, gourmand, yes. Gloves are ordinary, hat is cool hat. Yeah, sorry, just checking what I'm wearing. This looks like a nice place. You're into that sort of thing. Let's cut that open and eat it. Okay, I didn't become full, so let's cut that one up also and eat it. Hmm. It's a spell I haven't read yet. Let's read it. Recharging. Okay. Hmm. I'd like to recharge that one, I guess. That's a Komodo dragon. Uh, 
and I'm poisoned. Let's uh, sacrifice, let's sacrifice. A gilded ring. A. Did I just read the teleportation one? Great stuff. Let's read again. Ah, I only have one scroll. Positive energy. That's a good ring. But uh, not really. Drop it. A guy that I talked to before said that uh, it would be nice if there was uh, music playing in the background while I'm doing this dungeon. So I think I'm going to do that. What kind of mail do we have? Plate mail. Another identify scroll. This is an ice bear. Ring mail. Porcupine is dead. Uh, I thought this place was going to be a lot harder than it is. Wand of Draining. Give me a few seconds. Trying to kill that tree there, but that doesn't work. Wait a minute, don't I have fire scroll or something mm -hmm. lightning that won't help me very well oh it's done exploring um, go down Porcupine, you're dead. Basically, I think that the tutorial is over by now, in all honesty, because if you got them this far, then you don't really need a tutorial. <laughs> But it's good good to have, so I'll just continue as long as I can with this dude before I continue before I just die. I'm uh, thinking of uh, starting uh, like every time I do stuff, every now and then and now and again, I uh, I uh, save the um, I reached 13 nice let's sleep on that one for a few seconds so we don't wonder flame nice 
crocodile is nearby. I'm actually thinking of... Um, That was not in this room, it was up here. And that was going down. Because I wanted to go up. Pew. Uh, I was going for the forest over here. Start a forest fire. Uh, Or evoke okay that didn't burn did I do something wrong That's lightning. I wanted flame or evoke. Okay. Yeah, I don't seem to be able to do anything with these things. Um, but I am going to click invocation. Uh, fighting might be at the right place. Uh, evocation because uh, I want a spell. Um, I want to be able to throw spells, and uh, you can easily do that by using wands. That's a seven-headed hydra. This calls for brothers in arm and berserk. He died. Yeah, um, <clears throat> I have a tendency to keep playing while I'm trying to The large rock disappeared in a puff of smoke Odd fellow Um Yeah, I'm training rods because, uh, I mean, evocation because uh, having some kind of uh, spell is, is always nice. Komodo dragons. I'll actually do it like that. Done exploring. Then we go down. I think that maybe I should have uh, gone down into the lair before I walked to the uh, orcish mines, but uh, I really like the orcish mines, so I went for that first, which I did in the last episode. So if you're interested in, well, you probably watched the uh, 
last episode before you watch this one because I'm not the biggest YouTube dude in the world so you most probably already seen the first one that's a Komodo dragon Oops, I didn't even see the frog. Those frogs are devious. Oh, he grants me a gift. Oh. That's a ruined war axe. It's not worth it. Not a magic. Yep. It's not worth it, but it's always worth checking out what it is. That snail look awesome. He's dead now, but he looked awesome. Hmm, I wonder why I lack mana. I guess that snail took my mana or something. I might as well chop this up and eat. Yeah, these uh, enemies here are becoming kind of easy. Going down, we're in the fourth, fourth layer. Rune Drapier. Would be a nice one if it wasn't for me going with axes. Bum bum bum. Mord. You must choose. Maud wielding a vampire demon trident, wearing a plate armor, mysterious warrior princess from far off kingdom, on a quest to retrieve the legendary sword Anterax. Countless have been admirers. Countless have been their admirers. Who think about mode and forgot everything else? Looks like a wolf head or something. I think uh, I do with her like I usually do. Brothers in arms, berserk, then go nuts. And... Uh, that's actually a cool looking trident. Unfortunately the plate armor is just ordinary plate armor. Very hungry. Did I sacrifice her? Yes I did. A bear? Let's see how much food you give me. Ah, a naga, cool. That's an interesting lamp. And that's an entrance to something. Snake pit. So it's the snake pit. Uh, a 
lamp of fire. I guess I'll carry it with me. I bet that uh, I want to have some kind of uh, poison resistance when I'm walking down into... ...the snake pit. Remove curse, gained. Shoals. Okay. Shoals is an interesting place where I'd like to be able to fly to enter, but I guess we could go down there later. And uh, our first thing we're going to do is... Ooh, a scroll I haven't gotten yet. The first thing we're going to do is to get uh, poison resistant armor or something poison resistant. And uh, once we got the poison resistant we'll go to the snake pit. There we go. That's enough meat. Oh, I offered them to Trog. I was going to turn them into meat, I thought. I'll turn him into meat instead. Dead frog. Done exploring. I'm going to finish uh, the labyrinth. And by the labyrinth, I mean the place I'm in right now. only took half a year. Found a stone staircase leading down. dead. The problem with the um, me right now is that I'm I'm starting to become kind of overpowered. Well, not overpowered, but I can easily kill stuff and when that happens, I'm going to start to think that I'm too awesome, so I'm most probably going to run straight in and die at places. So that's what I'll be doing now. Trying to not... Okay, that one died pretty easily. Let's sacrifice some jacks and stuff. Let's see how I throw those F
Yeah, my throw isn't the best. Death Yaks. That wasn't ordinary Yaks. Ouch. If you watch my health now, it's down to nine. I'm going to walk towards some stairs. Okay, that didn't work very well. I am then going to drink Potion of Heal Wounds Quaff I'm going to slap this silly dude over the face Slap this silly dude over the face Sacrifice his corpse And then sleep Okay, there's some snake here Then sleep. Okay, there's a Komodo dragon. Then sleep. There we go. Seven headed Hydra. Let's just try to face him. Yeah. I can easily deal with those. That's good to know. That's basically the way you tell also how well you deal with things. You clobber them over the head. Oh, a hedgehog. That's you. Boring beetle. Blink frog. Yep. As you see, I keep killing things at the same time, like that. It's because I'm using a, a two-handed axe, so I hit everything around me at the same time. Like this, for instance. Done exploring. Then we're going down. Down, 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 down. An elephant. Okay. I wonder how tough you are. He's made me go backwards or go out. Erika. An elephant. Two elephants. That's how we deal with them. Um. You might call me a wuss for doing it that way, but uh, I think it's kind of clever to not do st stupid things. Hippogriff is dead. Sacrifice. 
might actually cut you open and eat you. It's another snake. Curved iron wand. Let's start drop stuff. O and H and P and don't drop P but drop P and F. Yes. And then pick up the iron wand. I just want to funnel them like this so that I don't do silly things. I see that I'm, my food is out, so whoops. My food is out, so it's time for me to fire Drake. It's time for me to eat stuff, eat meat. That is, of course, Snorg. I've reached level 14 and he dropped nothing. Elephant. Oh, he's beating me. Didn't see you there, elephant. No, I'm supposed to sacrifice you. Die. Why didn't I pick that one up? Picking stuff up. I have to check that later. I mean, letter regeneration. Do I want regeneration? I probably don't. Do I know? Demon Dragons. I probably have uh, out to pick up thingy non enabled anymore. There we go. Blink frog. That's a fog spell. That's useful. Ah, there she is. Ooh. 
crystal battle axe. It's a bit worse than uh, what I've got, but let's try it on. Let's see, speed, yes, minus cost, plus invisible and strength, plus two. Plus nine battle axe. I actually think this one is better. Let's start by sacrificing her. How do I find if something is better than the other, you might think? Well, you hit a lot of stuff with them. And find out that way. I was thinking that sounded a bit odd. It was a mimic. The stairs there. The spiny frog. Ah, there. I thought you were the wall. Sorry, frog. And the Hedgehog. Starting to be done with this floor. Griffin, 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 Griffin. Ah, there you are. I was hoping that, uh, whoops, I was hoping that uh, Trog would give me a better axe. I guess crystallized one is okay, but... It would be nice to get... Uh... Oh shit, now there are a lot of them. There you go. That's ordinary axe. Found scale mail. What kind of wolf is that? He's a dead wolf. Oh, that looks like a named one. What did I kill? Slice Spriggan Spriggan isn't very uh, named once. Yeah, that was pretty silly done of me. I pushed five until they got killed by my horns, basically. I 
I was thinking, why is this axe? Why did this axe just stop working? Grants me a gift. Court staff. Yeah, I'm not even going to pick that one up, I'm afraid. Mocassin. Engorged. Is that uh, mimicry, you think? No, it's the slime pits. Well then, done exploring. Isn't that an armor? Malta dragon hide. Let's pick it up. Yeah, they sure died. Speaking of died, I think uh, I'll stop my evocation at 10. I kind of forgot about evocation. That I had evocation on, that is. As you might, might see, I start to encounter beasts that I'm not used to, and they hit kind of hard. Blink frogs aren't a huge problem right now, I was about to say. Just before I got attacked by a swarm of them. I really, really need to reach my oh, four-headed hydra. Hello. Right, I need to remember to uh, switch weapon when I'm going against them, because uh, having a slicing weapon when fighting a Hydra uh, makes uh, a head grow for each time I hit it. This is starting to become a bit annoying. I feel sick. Uh, let's cure out of that one. Cough potion and sleep my headache out.
I don't know what's up with this place. But they really start to like to hurt me a lot. There. And there. Oh, HP restored. Sacrifice, sacrifice, pick up, ruined battle axe. Should I waste the identification scroll on it, maybe? Z of freezing. That's a good one, but not good enough for me. Drop. Short glowing staff. Oh. Evocation off. Where did all these come from? There we go. I might as well eat him. Time to drop you. Just had to check it out since it was a god gift. Let's cure out of that one. Off and then rest up. I'm running around without any weapon. Bringing forth your weapons into a fight is usually a good thing. Mm-hmm. 
Hello, Spiny Frog. Even though I was thinking this would be a short, uh, short video, it has turned out to be quite a long one. And uh, all I'm doing is the lair on, on this, in this video, because there's all always a lot of short de decisions that uh, that you. Um, do all the time. Let's see. Temple. Nope. TS in temple. And uh, I'll be leaving stuff in the temple that I don't need. Check for uh, poison resistant scrolls and stuff. Let's see, Guardian Spirit, Rage, and Regeneration. We're going to identify what kind of glowing Jasper Amulet we got there by pushing F. Read. H. Warding. Probably the worst in the world. Um, anywho, you might want to see what that ring is, yes. I was about to end the episode and use the rest, remainder of the time to throw things on the ground. Wizardry, that's a very bad ring. We want nothing of it. Um, yep, drop that one, and uh, drop that one, yeah, um, Anywho, I'm I'm thinking again. I should stop thinking and just play. No. Uh, anywho, I'll catch you guys later. It's been a very nice episode. Uh, next time we will be going for. Let's see what we'll be going for. The temple, the slime pits, the snake pits. I think. Uh, it's either the slime pits, the snake pits, or the shoals. Uh, snake pits sounds like a place that I want to go to, so it's going to be snake pits next time. Yep. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for the lair, everyone. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any comments, if you have any questions, just feel free to type them. And I'll answer them as much as I can. Anywho. Have a nice night. Bye-bye.